Hey everyone, welcome to Small Screen Reactions. My name is Andrew and I'm here to react to South Park Season 6, Episode 3. Very excited to watch this. Uh, last two episodes have been fantastic. Last episode with Aspen. Loved it. So, very excited to see what's going to happen in this one. But before we do, please don't forget to go check out Patreon. Link down below in the description box. Or go to patreon.com slash smallscreenreactions. If you want to get six plus episodes ahead right now, also... Also, you get Patreon exclusive shows that are only on Patreon, not on YouTube. Shows like Pox and Wreck, Attack on Titan, Battlestar Galactica, uh, what else do I got? Broadchurch, Chuck, Succession, some good stuff going on. So go check it out. Doesn't hurt, doesn't hurt to look, okay? Other than that, I hope you really enjoy this, and without further ado, here we go. Okay, we are still doing this intro. Last episode, we didn't have any intro, so... Yeah, look, Timmy gets part of the intro, but he hasn't been in the season yet. But Butters doesn't get... He gets that part. He doesn't get actually a part it's to sing in the intro. people all have horrible disfigurements. And you won't believe how we exploit them for your amusement. Oh, God. Oh, that sounds pretty good. Whoa, 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 whoa. Kenny? Kenny. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's awesome, Kenny. Oh, no, gosh, darn it. Oh. No, Kenny. <laughs> no, Kenny. Kenny's dead. Okay, Damn. Not Kenny. But I'm not going to wear this coat anymore, either. Yeah, probably not. Without wearing Kenny's old coat. Just be quiet, not Kenny. <laughs> the Mori Povich freak show is on. Yeah, yeah shh, not Kenny. Our next guest is a little girl who was born without a midsection. Please welcome Domla Jones. Oh. Hello, Mori. Uh, a little girl, and I'm very proud of you. Thank you. Can you tell the audience how miserable your life is? Oh my God. Uh, yes. Do people sometimes stare at you? Sometimes. Do they go, oh, gross? What the hell is that thing? Mm, I don't know. Damn. Well, your mommy told us, well, guess what, Damla? We're going to give you a $300 gift certificate to CD World in Torrance. CD World? Tune, because next we're going to meet a woman whose head was smashed in on a logger. Oh, God. And we're going to give her a makeover. Oh. This is terrible, dude. Mori yeah. Povich parades these poor black carnival freaks and then gives them prizes at the end as if to justify it. What a dick. It's, yeah, it's not the best. Right, I mean, people with disabilities? Yeah, I have a friend. He has a deformity. I think he'd be perfect for your show. Great. His condition? Oh, God. What are you going to say? Condition called chin ballolitis. Yes, his balls actually hang from his chin. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes, of course. He's very upset about it. Yes, he cries all the time. Mm -hmm. Miserable. Uh-huh. Really? What? Do they say they'll fly him out after tomorrow? Awesome. Wow. Cool. Uh, yes, I'm sure. There will, of course, be a prize involved. Great. I'll call you back in an hour. <laughs> no, thank you. Yes. This is going to be so funny. It sure is. But who's going to gonna be... put on Butter's chin? Uh, yeah. oh. I knew it was going to be Butter's, yeah. Butter's chin? Yeah. Uh, but Butter's, you should have really. known. I'm Butter's. You no, think? You're the one doing it, Butter's. It has to be you, Butter's. Think about it. Yeah. But fellas, if I go on Mari Pavish with my, my balls on my chin, my mm. parents are going to be really mad. We'll just He'll like... get grounded yet again. They'll never know. I'm sorry, but the answer is uh-uh. Uh-oh. Uh-uh. He's saying uh -uh. no. He's going to do it still. Yeah. Kenny would have done it. Oh... You guys, before I'm not Kenny, we know. Oh, oh, oh. every day that you're not Kenny because Kenny was cool. Yeah, damn. God, I wish Kenny was there. He'd put balls on his chin. He, he would. Was such an awesome friend. <laughs> well, come on, guys. Butters won't even put his balls. The guilt tripping here. Uh, gee whiz. You, gee you whiz. My mom and dad won't find out. Oh God. Now we're going to apply the latex with some spirit gum. That's fair gum, sure is stingy. Where'd you get mm -hmm. the balls from? Mold of his chin, and then made a latex scrotum and put two golf balls inside. Oh. Nice. Now we just blend the skin tones, add a little hair, and presto! Oh, creepy. They look great on you, buddy. They really do. I believe you owe us payment now. All right, the original avid cut of Star Wars episode. Oh, wow. They were in line. Why the hell would they want that anyway? Mm -hmm. That was a one suck balls. Uh -huh. Yeah, except Harry uh, hey, Butter's hey, chin hey. <laughs> Okay, here's your ticket, and they're gonna have a car waiting for you at the gate in New York. Wait, you guys aren't coming with me? Hell no, dude. Then we couldn't watch you on TV. What? She <laughs> has to go all alone? Uh, isn't Butters awesome for doing this, you guys? Yeah, he sure is. <laughs> doing all this to bring us back a prize. What a great friend. Butters, I'm Butters. So manipulative. All right, then. Oh, poor Butters. On set. Boy with balls on chin, this is man with foot on head. Girl oh. with rapid aging disease, wow. disfigured country singer, oh. and man with no face. <laughs> oh. Wow. Just take a seat on the couch, kid. I'll be back in a minute. Okay. <laughs> Boy, 
What circuit? The talk show circuit. Don't tell us this is your first one. Well, yeah. Well, you've all done it more than once. Oprah two times, Jenny Jones wow. once, Sally Jesse. You've only done Jenny once. Oh, I hate doing the Jenny Jones show. They don't even have their own hair people. <laughs> I'm doing Jenny tomorrow. Yeah. There are a lot of people like you all over the country, and we all do talk shows for a living. We all know wow. each other. We all kind of stick together to make sure our Wait till they find out you're fake. Like when someone lies about being a freak. <laughs> oh. Okay. Yeah, they'll make up a fake condition to go on these shows and then take our money away. We don't take kindly to that. Well, I can uh -oh. certainly see why. It's okay. Folks don't do it anymore. Not after they saw what we did to Lobster Boy. What? What happened to Lobster Boy? One day we all found out that Lobster Boy wasn't a real freak at all. Ooh. He was just an actual lobster. Like what? Crack so you know what we did to him? <laughs> what? One night all us freaks got together and we boiled him alive. Oh God. Oh, poor Lobster Boy. Yeah, I hate when people fake conditions too. The stupid fakers. We're glad you agree. Okay, boy, we both on the You're up next. Oh, Jesus, see me through this. <laughs> it's Chen. That's a good and him. <laughs> Please welcome eight and a half year old Napoleon Bonaparte from South Park, Colorado. What? Even the name is just fake. Well, they sure do. They always say to me, Butters, you're not Kenny. But I never said I was Kenny. But, they say Kenny. You, you, oh, listen, Kenny was Ken Butters, Butters. I'm tired of it. Listen. You hear me, fellas? Kenny's dead, and you just have to deal with it. Uh, yeah. Okay. But I mean, kids at school make fun of you because of your condition. What condition? You have balls that hang on <laughs> your chin. I do. How has he forgotten why he's there? <laughs> I guess they call me a turn ball boy, you know, <laughs> ball chin boy. When I was when I'm walking, they'll say, "Hey, that little turn ball." <laughs> <laughs> you will love this way too much, Hotman. But yeah, I suppose. And do they point at you and laugh? They make you wish you'd never been born. Damn. Make you wish to put an end to the whole More. miserable, wretched earth. Oh God, it's a kid. Sure. Because you are such a brave little chin bald man, <laughs> we're gonna send you directly from this studio to the world's largest putt putt golf course in what? the world. What? Really? That's the prize. Did he say the largest putt putt golf course in the world? Go on, you're going right now. Okay, but, but that's not, that's fair. not gonna. Buddy's buddy's <laughs> gets to go and we don't. Yep. <laughs> this did not work out well for you guys. Try to screw us over, that asshole. Well, it's not like he gave the reward. Puppet show? Yes. Hello. I'm calling because I saw your television program and I also have balls hanging from my chin. Oh my god. I'd like to come on and somehow get a freak show to the largest puppet golf course in the world. I'm sorry, but we're done doing freak shows for now. Oh. We're looking for people for a new. What's the new topic? Please help my out of control child. Oh. Uh -huh. Hey, I'm out of control. Really? Is your mother in tears every day over how disobedient you are? <laughs> uh, sure. To worry about you doing drugs and having sex at such a young age? Uh, yeah, sure. I can <laughs> crack and potpourri and... <laughs> potpourri. If you can get your mom to come on with you, we'd love to fly you out. My, my man? Well, that might be harder. <laughs> what is she doing? Man. Could you, um, go on the Mari Povet show with me and say that I'm out of control and do drugs and have sex so that I can go to the largest putt-putt golf course in the world? <laughs> But you're not out of control, Muffin. You're my perfect little gumdrop. I'm just asking you to lie for me. You love me, don't you? <laughs> of course I do. Pretty mother. Such a wonderful mother. Sweetie, don't. Then it's settled. <laughs> oh, I've got such a great mother. Mother. Just what did you think you were doing, Butters? Not only did you lie to us and say you were on a camping trip with Kyle's family. Yeah. Us on national television. Uh, this time, mister. You know, your grandmother saw the show and had a mild stroke. Oh, oh damn. Yeah, I didn't mean to almost kill grandma. I promise I'll never go on TV with balls on my chin again. Oh, you bet. But you can just take those balls off your chin and march right up to your room. Yes, ma'am. Serves me right. Mm -hmm. Putting balls on my chin about it. Why, I should be grounded for a month. He's so oh, harsh on himself. It's adorable and sad. Hey, Butters, those other freak people from the show were just over here looking for you. Oh, geez, uh -oh. they were? Yeah, they wanted to find you bad. Uh -oh. oh, God. What'd you tell them? I told them where to find you. Oh, no. What's that? Well, they want to kill me for not being a real freak. Oh. Uh, well, it serves you right for screwing us over. <laughs> he didn't do it. Oh, no. Oh, you're screwed. Oh, Jesus. No, I, I gotta get out of here. Wait, I can't go anywhere. I'm crowded. <laughs> oh, Christ, what a pickle. Just hide. No one answered the door. Napoleon? Napoleon no, Bonaparte? Why is your door unlocked? I think he's up here. Uh, oh, no. oh. What is <laughs> There you are, boy with balls on his chin. But well, we've got big news. The union is striking. 
What? What the union? union? Uh, that's why you came? We're tired of our crappy oh, prizes. Lord. So the uh, I can't freak strike, fellas. I I'm grounded. Grounded for what? For having balls on me. Huh? Oh. I mean nothing. I'm not grounded. Oh, Good, great. then you can march with the freaks of the world unite. Oh, if only, if only you were a better liar. These moms don't know what to do with their out of control kids. Young boys and girls so whorish on our show that it borders <laughs> on child pornography. Oh God. We're here. Her children are out of control. Now Vanessa here says that her 13 year old daughter Vanity is already doing drugs and having sex. Well, you named her Vanity, so. She, she calls me retard. That she says my goose is all dried up and nobody wants Damn. it. Damn. Oh my god. Oh. Oh damn. How old is she? She's tiny. You are really an out of control team. Yeah. Whatever. Whatever. My mom don't know ask her. I asked all my homies if they be down with it. You know, it's all good. Oh. You suckers. Okay, Cartman family, you're on in two minutes. Damn. Oh, God. I'm glad you're not that bad, Boopsy Goons. But if I'm not the most out of control teen, I might not win the prize. Yeah, he's got to be crazier. Wow. Come for us to be treated with the respect we deserve. We are a strong and diverse group of people with members like woman with crap like oh. body, incredibly obese black person, oh. man with brains outside of head, uh. and Liza Minnelli. <laughs> Talk shows have us on and get, they say they can get plenty of other stupid guests to go on their shows. So we must pick at those other guests. Oh, God. Oh, guys, I can't pick it, guys. You're not going to pick it? Who's not going to pick it? Oh, no. Oh, being called out in a big crowd. Oh, it's a fear of mine. Well, it's just my parents are, I can't pick it. Why? You're not a scab, are you? No, oh. I am not it's a scab. It's called he's a kid who has to be home. Incredibly obese black man. Excuse me, I'm not incredibly obese black man. I'm incredibly black obese man. Oh. Oh, okay. right, my bad. There's nothing his stupid mom can do about it. Oh. Why won't you kids behave? Oh, oh damn. Hey, he's not talking to you. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, Miss Cartman, you can't control your child? Oh, my little poopsie kins gets into no no. He's not even a teen. He's in fourth grade. Tickles. Well, your son made a video backstage. Let's take a look. Oh. Yeah, you trust. I can do what I want, bitch. Yeah, I'm sex, and I don't use tennis. And I hide body. I'll do what I want. I don't go to school, and I kill uh, people. Whatever. I'll oh. do what I want. Okay. Cutie. Well, let's bring him out. Here's Eric Cartman. <laughs> He's just trying to be just like her. Ooh, he loves playing with his Clyde Frog and Wellington Bear. Man, we're pretending we remember sex and drugs. Oh, I mean sex and drugs. Oh. <laughs> whatever, whatever, I do what I want. Mm -hmm. Oh, whatever, you ain't tough, ho. I oh. run with gang. Oh, yeah? I run with 12 gangs. Oh. And we only commit hate crimes. Whatever, I do what I want. Oh. Whatever, <laughs> you ain't bad, you ain't nothing. What the fuck? Heroin in the school bathroom. Whatever. I ran for Congress and won. Then I had what? sex with an intern, killed her, and hit her body. Oh. Whatever. What I the? Did what I want. <laughs> what we... Sir, I really gotta go home. My parents are gonna be sore at me. Napoleon, you need to understand something. For a union to work, all members must be prepared to make sacrifices and stick together. But also, but he's a child in fourth grade. Family too, Napoleon. We're like you. When we look at you, we don't even see the testicles on your chin. We see the testicles in your heart. Okay. When do we want them? Now! Oh, hamburgers, this just keeps on getting worse. Uh, oh, you had to jinx it. Dang, that because of our appearance, our organization is less important? Now, 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 I'm not telling you people that your union doesn't matter. I'm just telling you that you're not really people. No, oh, damn. Alright, that does it. It's time to bring out the big guns. Prepare the video sabotage. Oh, no, not the video sabotage. Why? What's the video sabotage? Moms who think their children are out of control. Whatever. I slaughtered five baby seals with my bare hands. Oh my Whatever. God. I'll do what I want. Oh now God. let's meet Jolene. Jo that she's flirting with older men and she's only four months old. What? Oh. Uh, 
but not a team that definitely not a team ha what you guys are born a four month old baby all she does so jolene exactly how flirts with older men mari it's like this whenever i have friends over to the house chantel will come waltzing in the living room completely naked she's a baby whatever i helped in a drive-by shooting whatever oh. i did you put job of the hut back into the original star wars movie Ooh. Oh. oh, that is out of control. <laughs> well, just last night, I had three gentlemen callers over to my house. Three. And Chantel took a by everybody. Oh, oh baby. You, you see? There she goes. Oh. There she goes. Oh. oh you go, game on. Wow. What the hell is this? A lot of decent, hardworking freaks in America are losing their talk show jobs to freaks of a different nature. Oh. Sure, everyone in this great country. Physically deformed freaks must be recognized. Or just these real freaks that make you all feel better about yourselves and oh, not being one. Okay. So next time you're watching Talico with freak freaks, and not just with people that are freaks because they're stupid trailer trash. <laughs> Damn. That's a look for the true freak label. Look for the true freak. Oh, freaks. how did he get in this? Remember somewhere a union's growing, our wage is growing to be the kids. Something. But who's complaining? We're TM, you were making a way. Oh, there's the butt face people. Uh, sorry, America, a little glitch there. Anyway. They're right. We should have never crossed that picket line. Come on, honey. Oh, uh, it worked. Make the other out of control kids take their clothes off, too. Whatever. I'll crap in Mari's pants. <laughs> Sir, the ratings. I gave you shoes and groceries, and this is how you repay me? Oh Lord. Very well. Come upstairs and we'll negotiate. Ooh, they won. They did it. Oh, thank God that's over. Now I can get back home. Butters, you have oh, screwed me oh. out of the prize for the last time. Oh. Oh no. I'm a bird. Jesus Christ! That out of control kid ripped porn Oh my God. Right off. Oh, <laughs> it's yeah. yes, good for Butters, but. Oh, they're gonna boil him. Hey, things actually turned out okay. Yeah. Until your parents. Yep. Matters? Oh, I know. Grounded. <laughs> it almost worked out really well for Butters. Well, this was uh, a freaky episode <laughs> with freaks of all kinds, including out of control teens and balls on the chin and all the freaky stuff. And Maury and all of it. <laughs> I don't know what else to say besides that. That was wild. Alright, very fun though. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you are having a fantastic day. Don't forget to check out Patreon again. Link down below in the description box. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time, okay? Bye.